suffer from huge insects and arachnids, and monster crustaceans and scorpions. Here are 18 of the biggest invertebrates on land. Yo! Hey, you! We always like welcoming new subscribers into the wildlife. So, thanks a lot for caring enough to click on that subscribe button to join us. Be sure and let us know what you think of all these invertebrates in this episode. Thanks! Queen Alexandra's Birdwing. The title doesn't refer to an actual bird. Although this insect has a wingspan that is comparable to those creatures, the females of the species are largest, with a body length exceeding 3 inches, and a wingspan approaching 10 inches. They're found only in the forests of eastern Papua New Guinea. Mountain Beaver Flea This parasitic insect is native to the American Northwest, and is named after the mountain beaver, which is the only creature the insect will feed on. The fleas can grow to around a half inch long. Even if it sounds like an oxymoron, that makes them the world's largest living fleas. Giant Moths The Atlas Moth and the Hercules Moth were named after a powerful titan and a legendary demigod, respectively. With such namesakes, you'd expect these insects to be big, and they are. The Atlas Moth is found in forests of Southeast Asia and has a wingspan that can approach 10 inches. Until recently, it was considered to be the world's largest moth. But the Hercules Moth, native to Australia and New Guinea, has a wingspan of 11 inches. Experts say its wings have the greatest surface area of any living insect. But if you're talking about sheer wingspan, the winner's the White Witch Moth. It's found in Mexico and has a wingspan approaching 11 and a half inches. Giant Gippsland Earthworm Australia has more than 1,000 native species of earthworms, and this one's the largest. Measuring more than 3 feet long and nearly an inch in diameter, this monster earthworm is found in Gippsland, in Victoria. With nearly 400 body segments, they can weigh close to half a pound. Giant Weta There are 11 species of this big insect, all of which are native to New Zealand. Certain specimens have been documented as some of the world's heaviest insects. Weighing around 2.5 ounces, it was heavier than a sparrow. Overall, the largest known species is the Little Barrier Island Giant Weta, which can measure to more than 2.5 inches or 70 millimeters long, and weigh more than an ounce or 35 grams. Even though they have a dangerous appearance, the insects aren't considered to threaten humans, though they have been known to leave some nasty scratches that could become infected. Titan Beetle This is amongst the largest of beetles, with a documented length exceeding 6.5 inches. While the Hercules Beetle, which by the way is coming up, has a greater length, much of that is due to its large horn. The Titan Beetle actually has the larger body. It also has a more dangerous reputation. It has sharp mandibles, known to cut into human flesh, that are powerful enough to snap a pencil in two. Hercules Beetle Including the horn, male specimens can measure up to 6.9 inches, or 17.5 centimeters long, and 1.6 inches, or 42 millimeters wide. The length makes them the longest extant species of beetle in the world. This species of rhinoceros beetle is native to rainforests from Central and South America to the Lesser Antilles in the Caribbean Sea. While the horns look capable of delivering a nasty bite, they are mainly used as the males fight each other during mating season. Tarantula Hawk Wasp These insects have a vivid coloration that serves notice to potential predators that attacking them is not such a good idea. Measuring around 2 inches, they're among the largest species of wasps, and they're known for delivering a wicked sting. The pain has been described as being an intense and unrelenting series of electric shocks. Their name's a reference to the female wasp's behavior of paralyzing a tarantula and using its body as a feeding ground for her larva. If that sounds scary, how about this? The wasp can be found worldwide, from India to the Americas. Asian Giant Hornet Native to the tropical and temperate regions of Eastern Asia, these insects are the world's largest hornets, and with bodies approaching two inches long, and a wingspan of some 3 inches, it's easy to see why. These creatures are just as fearsome as they appear. Their stingers measure about a quarter inch long and can inject mass quantities of a powerful venom. One victim of their sting described the sensation as similar to having white hot nails hammered into his leg. Giant Burrowing Cockroach can you guess where the world's heaviest species of cockroach is found? The answer would be, of course, Australia. They can weigh more than an ounce and measure more than three inches long. Despite those stats, they're not considered pests and they don't have wings, unlike other roaches. As their name indicates, the insects will burrow more than three feet underground to make a permanent home. Giant Huntsman Spider This 
big invertebrate was discovered in a cave in Laos in 2001. A lot of people might wish the arachnids had stayed there. Its leg span is nearly 12 inches. By that standard, it's considered the world's largest spider. Huntsman spiders are also found in Africa, South America, and Australia. Goliath Bird Eater. So while the giant huntsman spider is the largest as measured by leg span, this creature is the world's largest spider as measured by size and mass. Found in rainforest habitats of South America, this species of tarantula can weigh more than six ounces. Their fangs are strong enough to break the skin of a human. But luckily their venom is considered mostly harmless, with effects similar to a wasp's sting. Emperor Scorpion. Here's a scary looking arachnid found in West Africa, and it's noted for its size. Measuring up to eight inches long, it's one of the world's largest scorpion species. Despite its formidable appearance, these critters are known for being docile and carry a sting that's essentially harmless. That's because they prefer to use their powerful pincers to crush and dismember their prey. While their bodies are black, when they're exposed to ultraviolet light, the creatures will glow bright blue or green. Giant Forest Scorpion. These scorpions are similar in size to the species we mentioned just previously, but because they measure around nine inches long, that makes them the largest scorpion species in the world. These critters are also similar to emperor scorpions in their preference to crush their prey with their pincers, as opposed to using their stingers. They are found throughout India and Sri Lanka. Giant African Millipede. Exceeding some 15 inches long and more than two and a half inches in circumference, it's one of the largest millipedes on the planet. And while millipede might imply the creature having a thousand legs, it only has around 256 of them. Although the number can vary among individuals. They're native to the lowland forests of East Africa, as well as parts of Southern Arabia. When threatened, they'll coil up to expose their hard exoskeleton for protection. They can also release an irritating liquid from their body, which can be harmful if it's introduced to the eyes or mouth. Amazonian Giant Centipede. This venomous creature can reach lengths up to 12 inches long, and with dimensions like that it's no wonder that some sources claim it's the world's largest extant centipede. It's found in northern South America, in rainforests and dry forests as well, and its behavior is as fierce as its appearance suggests. They're known to feed on tarantulas, frogs, lizards, snakes, and birds the size of sparrows. These centipedes are even known to crawl up cave walls to the ceilings where they anchor themselves to snatch bats as they fly by. While the centipede's venom is deadly to its prey, it's considered too weak to kill a healthy adult human, but it can cause severe skin irritations, as well as symptoms including chills, fever, and weakness. And before heading over to our number one invertebrate, Let's take a time out for an honorable mention. We've been focusing on invertebrates found on land, but as you know, the seas are filled with such critters, from jellyfish to colossal squids. But we're giving a shout out to the giant isopod. There's about 20 species of these big crustaceans, and they're often noted for their resemblance to the common woodlouse, which some experts consider to be a terrestrial cousin. So there's your tie-in to our land invertebrates. Of course, the woodlouse is much smaller than its aquatic relative. They grow to around three centimeters, possibly larger. But extreme specimens of isopods known as supergiants can reach lengths approaching 30 inches and weigh nearly four pounds. Great numbers of these arthropods are found in deep, cold waters from the Atlantic to Indian Oceans. Wood lice, meanwhile, can be found around the world. Did you know they're the only species of crustacean to inhabit land instead of water? Coconut crabs. The largest terrestrial invertebrates can weigh around nine pounds and grow more than three feet long from leg to leg. These tough looking arthropods get their name due to their fondness for coconut meat. The creatures have been observed climbing more than 30 feet up a tree with a coconut in their claw. Dropping it to the ground, the crab will access the meat after the husk nut has cracked open. Larger specimens are known to use their powerful claws to break open the coconut shell into smaller pieces. Those pincers can injure a human, so if you encounter one, keep your hands to yourself. The big crabs are found on islands in the Pacific and Indian Oceans. 